she stopped breathing over a hundred times. The day has finally come that we're doing sheetrock. Welcome to the vlog. Davey went to the temple, which leaves me here. I got all the kids off to school for he's still asleep. He's been sleeping. He has bed options, y'all. <laughs> he chooses this. He seems comfortable as can be. He likes it there. He he was on a bed last night and he came in a few minutes later. He's like, I actually want to sleep in here. <laughs> so he, that's where he is. But it's a laundry day for the bed. And I'm gonna show you how easy this new Betty zip base is to launder. It also comes with another sheet. So I'm gonna be able to unzip this and immediately put on a fresh clean sheet and then go and wash these. So if I wanna take a middle of the day nap when all the clothes are in the laundry, I still can. This is awesome, so here we go. Also, I'm gonna put a link in the description to Betty's because they have tons of options. They even have just sheets if you wanna just buy zip sheets and then you can add whatever duvet covers on top. They have duvet covers now. They even have zippers on their pillowcases. It is the best actually because no more, like look at this fine little zipper. It's so tiny and just the pillows are so pretty. Look how pretty the pillows are. I mean, you know what? I'm gonna wash the pillowcases too. Let's just make the whole bed smell good. And I'm gonna tell you another tip. I use the um, Diva wash, and then it smells so good until it's time to wash again. Like, I love when my bed smells like the Diva wash. So here we go. You just do that all around the base. And then it has this little thing that holds it on. So easy. Here's my new clean one. I already washed it with the Diva wash a while ago and it still smells good. Let me just Another thing that's really awesome is this Sound Sleep Medical. I guys, I talk about this all the time on my Instagram. I don't know how many times I've talked about it on YouTube, but it is amazing and I I use it and it stopped my snoring. Like I knew I snored. I did not know I had sleep apnea. I went in, I did the free, like I went in and picked up the device. You bring it home, you hook yourself up. It has instructions. It's not hard. You go to bed and then you wake up and you just drive the device back to them and drop it off at the, the um, office. And then they analyze the data on the machine. And so you get to sleep in your own bed. It's not scary. It's not annoying. It was just like, it was a little bit different to like have all the stuff because you have like a thing in your nose to monitor your breathing. But I had stopped breathing like 16 times and one of them was for like 30 seconds. Like I just, you're just like stop breathing. Um, so they said I had mild to moderate. Davy's mom did the test. <laughs> she stopped breathing over a hundred times and it was severe and one of them was a minute and a half or something like that. It was like 90 seconds. Like it was crazy, almost 90 seconds. <laughs> so she's like, no wonder why I wake up so much in the night. Like you startle awake once you're about to die. And <gasps> like, So she started using it and she has been monitoring her sleep. Does not have the problem anymore. Like she is not snoring at all. Well, I mean, she might still have some sleep apnea a little bit, but like it's holding her jaw forward. So her tongue is not going back and like blocking off. So that's what was happening. It's like your tongue kind of slides back in there. And that's what happens when you're snoring is it's like rattling between your throat and your tongue. And if you pull your jaw forward, it keeps more room for your tongue to stay down and it doesn't fall back there and... So that helps with the sleep apnea. Not every single person can um, get away from the machine, but I feel like this is so much less invasive. So if you don't have like a reason to be on the machine, I just feel like this is better. 
I would, would not want to do the machine. That seems terrible. Um, anyway, I know a lot of people have to, but I'd look into this. If you are on the machine, look into this. It's awesome. It just holds your mouth in a certain position where you're not snoring and it helps your sleep apnea. So it sounds sleep medical. I do have a code. If, if you click on the link, Davey will put that link in the description too. There'll be a few links today, but that one, if you click on it, it takes you to where you can fill out the thing to get the free in-home sleep study. And then if once you've done the sleep study, if you decide you want the device, like up until that point, you're never paying a cent. And then if you decide you want the device, I have the code April that gets like $50 off the device. So the device is worth every single penny if you need it because if you sleep better and you're not snoring <laughs> and you're not gasping for air five times, 20 times a night, you just feel so much better in the morning. I didn't use this for a little while because I was sick and my nose was like stuffy and I noticed a huge difference. So yeah, there you go. Hi, Frank. Good morning. <laughs> we got an exciting day coming up. April is here doing her nails. Yeah, and I should be bottling How's that working out? But I thought, you know, I better do my A lot time. of them could use a couple of days of ripening. They're not all perfectly. Hey, like, the thing is, too, though, is that if my nails are done here. really clean and like my Lego out, then I don't have to worry about them having dirt underneath them. Frank's working on his Lego car. He wants to tell you about that. Um, the day has finally come that we're doing sheetrock downstairs. I've been talking about it for a long time. And uh, Zaid helped me carry in. Turned down my cereal. <laughs> yeah, that's, cereal. Oh, that's one of my favorite things to do when the kids scoop them off a plate of something. Oh, I hide it when they turn their backs. Can you have some cereal? Yes, you can. Uh, I'm going to show you the. I'm using those filler words again. I'm going to. Show you the load we did. We got 40 pieces of sheetrock today, and I think I need 135 total. But. Here's all the sheetrock. We got 40 pieces, and we, I borrowed this hoist to get it up to the ceiling. I think I used it a long time ago. My brother-in-law's owned this for like 15 years. Got some more here, and some more sitting over here. They'd help me carry it in, but yeah, here we go. I'm gonna get the first one on. Okay, this is where I'm at right now. I was able to get three in. I promise to show you the process. This thing is awesome. And this thing is life-changing. Wow, I really love this toy. I gotta show you how easy it is to screw in with that. And I gotta go to a dentist cleaning, but yes, I'll be back. I was missing the beam there. I was like, why isn't this thing working? But yes starting to look like a room. Okay, I put the bottles in the dishwasher on the sanitize cycle. It says it's supposed to take three hours, but it uses super high temperature and they were already clean when I stuck in there. So as long as it gets the jars really hot and I didn't put soap in there, just let it run without soap so that at any given moment I can pull hot jars out and it will be hot for another three hours and I know that, so that's good. And then I have, first things first, we need to make a fresh peach pie, right? And I, well, I guess it's not a fresh peach pie because I'm gonna cook it, but um, I'm gonna just make a peach pie, but then I also want to make a fresh peach pie, so I need to look up the recipe for that too. I think I'm gonna do both. And maybe we'll also share one with a neighbor. So I'm gonna make some pies.
All right. Uh, got my supervisor down here checking things it's out. So good. And we got a lot done. We got the ceiling. Sounds like a room now. Wall, big old wall, big wall, cubby, and this wall. The girls are so excited. We'll finish more later. Yeah, they oh, are so excited. excited. So, you found it? we're going to call it a night. I'm starting to smell myself, so I will go and take a shower, and then we'll sit in the hot tub. That does it for the vlog today. Got a lot done, feeling good in the neighborhood. Uh, April worked so hard on the peaches today. Yeah, I realize. Being a dance mom and canning doesn't mix. <laughs> a few balls got dropped today, but that's okay. Everybody got to dance. So we're gonna end the vlog now. Not me. You didn't dance? Uh, no. You gotta play with Play-Doh, okay. Everybody but Frank got to dance. Thanks for watching, find good and everything. See you tomorrow, bye-bye. <laughs> hey, Daisy, we're on Cherry Hill. Hey, Say hi, hi, baby. Dallin, you wanna do anything for the camera? Okay. Any tricks? Now go under the water and jump up. Zader? Wow. Zader, you having fun? Show me how you can swim for the camera. Swim, come to me. Oh, he's swimming. Hunter! And Hunter's swimming too? Oh. Best friends. Hey, careful. <coughs> Shell's here and Grandma with the twins. Mom, <laughs> you having fun? I am. Right. That's your new phone? Yeah.